Can I have the honor of catching a pass from Patrick Mahomes? Yeah, yeah, for sure. No, I'm gonna have the honor of throwing a pass to C. Smith. I'm a little bit nervous. Man, Agent 89 wakes <laughs> up warm. It's real now. Woo! Let that thing hang. Let that thing hang! Right down the middle. Don't doubt me. Hey, I'm Steve Smith Sr., 16-year veteran, wide receiver in the NFL. Big play, my big play every big game. Thousands of people's jobs play a part in making the NFL happen. But today, I'm working with the Kansas City Chiefs equipment staff to learn how they prepare the kicker's football for game day. Let's go. Allen? Hey. I'm Alan Wright. I'm the equipment manager for the Chiefs. Steve Smith? I know who you are. How are you? I'm very good. Very good. We're uh, excited to have you uh, come in here and be a K-ball guy. So I'm a K-ball guy. What does a K-ball guy do? K-ball guy uh, gets first, all the... First one. Okay. Do you believe I can handle the job? Uh, I don't know. That's to be determined yet. Yeah, it's not easy. Okay. Yeah, it's not easy. It's going to be a challenge. Okay. All right. I'm up for a challenge. I knew you would be. Yeah. Uh, we're going to do everything we can to make you the best K-ball guy in the National Football League. Yes! I'm All right. ready. All right. How long have you been an equipment manager? Uh, I've been with the Chiefs. Uh, this is actually my 40th year. 40th? Yes, sir. So you've seen a lot of people come and go? I've seen a lot of people come and go, including a lot of punters and kickers. Hmm. Today, what yes. we have in store is I'm going to take you out to the field and introduce you to Harrison and Tommy Townsend. Okay. And they're going to walk you through the way they like their balls prepared. Mm. Then I'm going to bring you in here, introduce you to Chris Shropshire, one of my assistants. Okay. He's going to actually show you how to physically prepare the ball the way that Harris and them like it. Okay. Do I get a uniform, Randy? You will. You'll get a uniform. I'm, I'm going to give you something now, but we will also put you in what's called a Group C uniform, which is what the K-ball guy wears on game day. Group C. It's NFL blue, so that you're neutral. Neutral. Yes, sir. Okay. All right. Do I get a hat? Uh, we might. You no know, hat, no service. I'm not service. sure if it's in the budget, but we'll, we'll try. No hat, no service. Okay, we'll get you a hat. Okay. What's up, buddy, Colin? What's up, man? How you doing? Good. How you good, doing? Good, good. Yeah, now you're going to talk to the, the important people. The ones that really care about how they're done is right there. You got the punter and the kicker over there, so I appreciate well, you coming out, though, dog. I do have a, one more question. So you're playing with a dirt, with dirt on football. And then yet you lick your fingers all the time. Bro, so this is my so this is my oh. pet peeve. Right when, especially, <laughs> especially these last few years, yeah. I, I, I like I think about it, but I can't not do it. All right, man. <laughs> it's funny you say that. Dude. I literally I literally think every single time I'm like, nah, this guy, I gotta do it though. Looky here, looky here. We're gonna kick some field goals. We got the goon squad. <laughs> What's going on? What's up? How you doing? Good. Steve. Yeah, What's up, Tommy, brother? good to see you. Harrison. What's up? How you guys doing? Good, man. All right, so tell me, what's the difference between a quarterback ball and a K ball? An unconditioned ball is harder to snap, it's harder to catch. Conditioned ball, easier to snap, easier to catch. With a K ball, we want this ball to bend as much as possible. So you take that brush and you try to balloon the ball up, and then that's going to make the ball go farther off your foot. You guys are going to teach me how to do it, but I just got to, I got to, I got to show you. I, I got a few skills, not the best, but let's just see. Just look. Ooh, oh, my goodness. Okay. See? Yeah. Boom. <laughs> I don't need no sneaking like holder. <laughs> I don't need no long snapper. I'm a built-in business. See, if you, if you can do that without warming up, then, like, we might as well just go right into it. Man, Agent 89 wakes <laughs> up warm. I don't know what you're talking about. You think you can hit an extra point? How, how far is that? 33-yard field goal. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. You want, the, uh, you want the broken in ball or you want the brand new ball? Listen, I'm trying to survive. I need the broken in ball. <laughs> 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 we got something going right here. Try to get ready. Set. Oh, wow. let's go. Let that thing hang. Bro. <laughs> Let that thing hang. Right down the middle. Don't doubt me. Right down the middle. Let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and get to work. I got this ball to work on. <laughs> get this ready for the mall. Hey. How's it going? Good. Shrop. Steve. Hey, nice to meet you. How you doing? Oh, doing awesome, man. How you doing? I am here to condition a football. Oh, awesome. We, we, we do that well here, so. You do? Yes, sir. Okay, how long you been doing it? 
This is my 27th year doing it. 27? 27 year. years. Well, let's get started. So basically on game day, mm -hmm. two hours and 15 minutes approximately. Okay. When the officials get to the stadium, yep. we go to the officials' locker room mm. and meet a representative from the other team. Okay. And the people with zebra that they they activate the chips in the ball. There's chips in There's the ball? There's chips in the ball, just like the game Like balls. guacamole? No, not, not oh, I wish. Oh, okay. That'd be okay. good. All right, but, all right. But um, sensor chips that tell them, you know, speed and all kinds of different angles and stuff that they use for analytical stuff okay. or whatever that's above. All right. There's a box of six balls. The home team picks a ball that they think is going to condition the best. Then the visiting team picks one, and you do that through the six balls. Mm. So then you go to your respective areas to work on the balls. You get one hour to make the balls the best you can. Mm. So what equipment are we using to yep. make the so balls the best? We use uh, some hot water and some brushes. Hot... OK. And towels, then, you know. So that's it. All right. So. So once you get to your locker room, you pick out the balls, you okay. know, and you get some, you just get, get the ball and help get some of the nice red stuff off. Mm -hmm. So you can see we got a good amount of stuff off that one. Yep. And so with doing all of this, what have you found over your 27 years, the comfortability of, of, of the different guys? Yeah. Most of the kickers are all the same. Whoa! Yeah. The, all the kickers are the same. I, this is a Wilson. This is a Wilson, Wilson approved football Wilson scrubbing approved brush. Football yep, they, scrubbing they, brush. Football scrubbing brush. They come, they ship them in with the balls. So the first thing I, I do is I use the backside of the brush and I just scrape the ball and, and try and scrape some of these bumps off. Mm. And what is scraping the bumps? Uh, it, it just makes gives a better airflow and makes the ball smooth for the kicker's preference. Tell yeah. me if I need some more work. Yeah, I think we're ready for a brush now, and then okay. we can maybe repeat this cycle one more time. Oh. So, next thing you use the regular bristle side now. Okay. And give the ball a good polish. You take any pride when you have the game-winning yeah. kick? I mean, they, they do all the work, well, you know. Well, but, yeah, but, but you're part of the <laughs> team. Yeah, so yeah, part of the team. It feels nice, you know, you contributed, you know. Yeah. Harrison Butker. The kick. Tell me how I've yeah. done. How's that? Oh, that's, How's that? that's great. Really? Yeah, you're there. Are you serious? Oh, for sure. No, he's lying. I, no. Mine doesn't feel as good as yours. So then one last thing I do just to give it a good look is um, to darken in the seams with the back of the brush. So I just take the smooth flat side of the brush here. And why is darkening in the seams? What does that do? Just lets the kickers and punters think that, you know, the seams are the seams are broken good and they're nice and soft. Hmm. So these punters and kickers, they can be a little high maintenance, huh? Oh, they, not too bad. It's cold for yes. <laughs> <laughs> so here you go. You have a NFL prepared ball. NFL prepared ball? I think you, you, you might be able to kick this one. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? I am here reporting for duty. Nice it's to see you. It's game day. What do we got? Well, I'm excited uh, to uh, introduce you to somebody here in a minute that's going to take you and show you the ropes. His name is Brian Sloan. Brian? Hey. Hey, Brian. Steve. Hey. Brian How Sloan, nice to meet you. Steve Smith Sr. Is Brian in charge of me? He is. So if I get in trouble? All on him. You ready here for that? Here we go. Brian doesn't know what he got himself into today. <laughs> Let's go. These are the pregame balls for uh, Butker and Tommy. That we get them all at 13 pounds. Okay. So we'll add air to them. Get them right at 13. Don't screw it up, Smitty. Don't screw it up. Boom. Job finished. Being that you were well at catching the ball, let's see yes. how well you are at throwing it in. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna go out to the to the numbers and have you toss it into me so gonna, like I'm the back judge. We're going to simulate a situation. Simulate that it's fourth down. Fourth down, OK. All so right. Let's not screw this up, Smitty. Yeah. I come out to the field. Here you go, referee. Boom. There you go. A little higher? A little higher. All always, right. But also, also, always make sure they're looking at you Yeah. when you go to throw. Here we go. Bang. There you go. Perfect. All right, B. All right. I'll, I'll see you before the game. So we got the balls delivered. They're going to open them up, and they're going to activate the chips in them, make sure they're all good to go before okay. we do our thing. We got to condition these? We, yep, that's the next step. We got one hour? Well, technically, it's like 59 minutes, 58 minutes. Y'all got to hurry up. Y'all killing our time. <laughs> so yeah, we'll open these up. Hey, guys, head the balls back to the locker room at 4.15, please. Yes, sir, we got you. Thank you. Right. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. 
home team gets the first pick. Okay. And then we alternate. All right. All right. Got my first one. Is there a second one? All right. Which one do you think? Which one do you want here? Let's go with this one. All right. There you go. All right. All right. That's pretty intense. <laughs> we got 30 minutes. 30 minutes left? You tell me. Yeah, that feels real good. Take a little bit more brushing, and then we'll hit the back side. Feels great. Damn, yours is pretty pristine right here. So now we got them all done here. We're going to put our numbers on them. All right, we're out. Right. So we're odd, so we'll go one, one here. Then right beside the weak number on this one, let's put a number three. All right. And right here, same place. On this one, we'll put ball number five. Completes our process here. All right. There's yours. We'll walk these over to the officials now. Okay. And get them checked in. All right. Well, guys, you know, the idea we always say, you're part of our crew, right? So you're going to help us make the flow of the game exactly like it's supposed to be at NFL standards. Make good throws, guys. We do not want a ball on the ground. All right, let's have a great game, cool. fellas. I'm a little bit nervous. Why well, you've been in the middle of a I've been NFL in the middle football. of a football game, yeah. but I've never been in the middle of a, like, being a K-ball guy. Like, it's so much like messing up, giving it to the wrong guy, giving the wrong ball. Like, I don't want to be that guy. One request. OK. Be gentle. Uh, <laughs> this is the NFL. There's no such thing. Yes. I hear the quarterbacks, like, they, that takes all day. They say you're very particular about your ball. Yeah, so I, 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 I he makes probably. Are you a ball snot? I am, for sure. He makes probably 35 footballs every week, and I pick out, like, 12 or whatever it is. Oh, so you're that guy. Yeah, I got to go and throw it. I got to fill it, see how it feels. I throw it a couple times, and I'm like, yeah, that's good or not. Got the whole career. Get this guy over here. Get this guy over here. Look, you, you can tell when you're not playing. Yeah. <laughs> what a beautiful day. <laughs> He's a, a little, just a stroll in the park. It's a stroll in the park. Hey, so we're talking. He's a football snob. Yeah. They do 35 footballs. He picks out 12. 12? 12. You didn't know this? No, I didn't know this. I didn't know it was that serious. It's not. I think ball three is mine. All right. I just can't screw it up. So I know where to go, all that stuff. I just got to change into my gear, and I'll be ready. You got this. All right. Got this. You, you, do you trust me? Yeah, I trust you. Trust? Am I in a circle of trust? trust. We'll, be, we'll be able to tell if we go out there and see a quarterback ball lined up there on fourth down. I got faith. I got, got faith in you. Yeah. All right. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it. Let's get it. See you out there. the home team to kick off. It's real now. Woo! I love it. When we are on the sidelines inside the box, make sure we give Coach Reed a bubble. Oh, I know. I, know. I ain't stupid. Yeah, I know, I know, but I just. You always stay the hell out of the way to cut the head coach. Correct, yeah. I just want to make sure that you and I both don't get no, you, get, you are going to get in this way. I shall not. <laughs> All right. If that man fall down, I will jump back and let him uh, No trust fall here. Short, short, short. Here it comes. Too bad. Okay. Let's get right here. Right here. Come on, now. Come on. Out. Here you go. Ball. Over there playing my ball. They didn't give my damn ball. Hey! Hey! You should have given him the bubble. I was giving him the bubble. Hey. Nickel's holding up dollars now. You have my ball over here. You're supposed to bring it over here. We're outside the bubble. Over here playing my damn ball. Lollygagging. It's that good hole. Kick is on the way, and it is good. 
was really good football. Really? That was really good football. Oh, you did thank great you. job. I appreciate it. Thanks. Got the seal of approval right there. I like it. When he makes it, if it goes over the goal, give him that ball. If not, give him no, the same ball. Three. Yeah. If it goes over the net, uh -huh. give him that one. Give who? The referee okay. back behind. Uh That's a one. What? Listen, this is the fun stuff, bro. I'm ready to play, bro. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I'll build it. I'll build it. Oh, Yo, base pass, defense. Hey, Alan, I really appreciate the opportunity, man. I learned a lot. I learned it just not just showing up, right? Chasing out the balls, getting everything right with the referees, cleaning it, just everything that it takes. It's not an easy job. You guys do a heck of a job, so I, pre I appreciate the opportunity to work with you guys. No no problem. We are glad to have you. Um, I think, I hope my staff gave you good instructions. Yes. And I know that by speaking to them, uh, they loved having you. And they said don't quit your day job, yeah, but, yeah. but they gave you a decent grade. They gave you a B. Minus. Okay. And, but I think the minus was because of the hat. Yeah. But so I think you was a solid B. Okay. And we would love to have you back anytime you want to come. Appreciate it. Well, I'm sorry, but unfortunately, no hat, no service. So <laughs> just gotta work with it. Appreciate okay, it. No problem. All right. I'm going to every team in the NFL to try to find the most interesting job. If you have something you want me to do next, leave a comment below. See ya. Can I have the honor? of catching a pass from Patrick Mahomes. Yeah, yeah, for sure, though. No, I'm going to have the honor of throwing a pass to C. Smith, now, you know I'm what I'm saying? I'm not going to run very far. I got just... you. <laughs> you know. I like that. I feel good now. I'm done. Appreciate you, my dog. Man, appreciate yes, you. You're a hell of a yes, player, I appreciate bro. you, man. I'm keeping this ball, too. <laughs>